Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to download and open files on Pipaclo Designer 3. This is to get started, you'll want to go into my Orbital War Mask video and then scroll down to the description. On there I left two links, one for Pipaclo Designer 3 and the other one to the file. You will, you will want to click on the link of course and then it's going to take you to media file. Media fire, I should mean. And then you download, and you want to s s select save file, and then click OK. I already downloaded, so there's no need for me to do that again. Once you've done that, you want to go into Pepper Crew Designer Three. You will want to go to where it is you download your file or where it's saved. It should be in downloads and there's three ways you can open this file on here I'm going to show you the easiest way right now which is which is click and drag and there it is another way you can do this it's pretty much the same as just now it's just a little longer you just want to go and look at your file and open it and there it is now this is going to be the longest long way around to get doing this if you can't do the first two methods for whatever reason you want to go into file I mean to start computer and bring up a new window you want you go into your hard drives and then go into program files 86 and then scroll down till you find a folder named Tama software whoa sorry about that so there it is. You will want to go into sample. And most of you will not have any of these except for the color cube and the dice, which are the two default ones that should be in there when you download Pepakura. From there you want to go into your other back into your downloads and then just click and drag. I already have it in there, so I'm gonna just hit cancel. You then go back into Pepacura and then go to open and then locate that folder you were in just now. So you're going to program files, locate Thomas Software. There it is. And then then you just click your folder. I'll, I'm gonna click, I'm gonna go find my Daedric helmet. There it is. And so, something you guys, some of you have been asking me is how to make the helmet a little bigger because it is kind of small. And I even, and I believe I do say so in the video as well that it, it was a little small, so I have to change, scale it up. So to make this helmet a little larger, you want to go into 2D menu change scale scale factor if I remember correctly I made mine for 425 millimeters and then here okay the helm is still the same but the scale is been scaled up of course as you can see here that the pieces do not fit correctly and they are overlapping page between pages. Before you do it, move around anything in there, you want to go into File, Print, and Paper Settings. And right here is this side margin. You want to bring that down all the way to five. And then hit OK. From there, you will now want to start adjusting your pages. I mean your pieces. You just want to left click on that. And then hold and move it around. I'm gonna move it down to this page. And I'm gonna bring this piece with it. Just so I can show you guys something. So you can see that the piece barely fits on there. But what you can do is right click on that and then select rotate and select any point you want. And from there you just click anywhere on the page and rotate your piece. Once you rotate it, you right click again, 
and then go to select a move and then choose left click once again and roll to your piece and then from there you just do that to all of them until you're happy with it and once you once you're happy with what, what you have you're going to file and then you just print it it's going to print some around 30 images for this one if you were to fix it nicely and that should that should be it guys i mean not not a, there's really not a lot to it not too complicated or at least i hope it's not too complicated but if you do have questions let me know in the comments below and i will try to get to you guys as soon as i can if i'm not too busy all right thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye